Today I'll show you how to use there you go. Yeah. This PS3 controller with this PC. I know, that's a Gundam image. Well, first a lot of people do is well first of all a lot of people do is they connect it to the PC, run everything perfectly, but alas it doesn't work. And well, you have to turn off your PS3. You got all these demos. Yep, need to install that. Well, first, you start by pressing the PS button, and you just turn off, turn off the system. Right, turn off the system. Up. Yes, I have uh, successfully. When that's red, I have turned off the system. Yep, I've turned off the system. Now there's a, a button. There's a button. You see my hand? Yeah. See where it's going? Yeah. So toward the PS3. Toward the back. See, there's a button back there. So watch the red light. It's gonna let me just turn off that button. Where it goes? There we go. Oh, it's off. Now it's completely off. Now what you do is you take the controller. Well, that's what a lot of people miss out. They don't turn off the PS3. They just leave it on standby mode, which doesn't really help. So. Oh, there's my cable. Where'd it go? The hex. Uh, is that the cable? Yes, that is the cable. Wait. There we go. Well, let's uh, do it. Done. Done. Then, well, it's really hard to see. Just plug this in. Now that that is done, it's finished. You should see, you should see four lights blinking. The next part of this video is to your right, to your left. I don't know. It's in my comments where I just put up the link, so you could you could see it from there. They're both there. Okay, thank you. The next part's over there, so don't be confused. Where to go? See.